Should I start off this video by just getting drunk? Maybe. I don't Okay, first off, can't wait for this whole, can't wait for this quarantine lockdown to end <laughs> because, because girl, I am wearing my bathing suit underneath my shirt and I look cute and dummy thick in it and the thing is that I decided to put a shirt over it instead of just taking off the bathing suit because, well, um, Let's just say, if I were monetized, this would get demonetized very quickly. It's not so much made for a public pool as much as it's made for an Atlantis cruise line. <laughs> okay, so we're going to talk about, oh, this last episode of RuPaul's Drag Race post rusical episode. I can't remember its name, goddammit. And I'm going to be resurrecting one of my old looks that I have, and you know, it's just going to be fun. But anyway, I have thoughts, so yeah. So if you guys don't know what's happening in this episode, I'm sorry, um, but I don't care. I'm giving you a spoiler right now. You click on this video. Anyways, uh, apparently the girls are having to make their own like commercial or product and it first of all I gotta ask who the hell is Bob Harper I can't remember him from is he from the biggest loser uh someone comment below I probably won't google him um, I probably won't google him like ever <laughs> I doubt he's watching this but um He doesn't know what a jump take is with Jackie's. <laughs> and Gigi's just like, oh. <laughs> it's hot in here. Ooh, the shade. Ow. Uh, get your nose, get your nose, get your nose, get your nose. Time to blend, time to blend. But, you know, and I'm a little more, and you know, I was a little worried for Heidi, but, uh, you know, she she gonna do good. She gonna do good. I got good feelings about Heidi. I've already watched this before, so I'm already giving a spoiler. Heidi wins. Blah 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 blah. <sighs> it's just funny. Bob Harper doesn't know what a jump take is. He's been in television for how long? I'm just you know saying and it's a 1960s reference, and he's old enough. Friends and make your simple life jam. And of course, Jane's going in a hundred and being the try hard she we all love and know. America, please believe me. I did not sleep with that woman. I'm terrible at this impersonation. Shut up. I am James St. James. Welcome to my fish. <laughs> I don't have a speech impediment. I've just done that many party drugs. <laughs> Shut up. Can I just say I live for James St. James and the fact that um, James was a uh, guest on America's Next Top Model and taught the girls how to get their freak on. I mean, the original party monster themselves. Who who better? Can't forget that neck. Can't forget that neck. Ooh. I'll be honest, I hate doing my neck. But apparently the hiders hate it even more that I don't do it. Oh my god. Mm. You know, they can all suck on a donut. I don't care. 
stuck on my donut. I am that thirsty. The unholy thing that is underneath this shirt. You will never know unless you come to my house or a private pool party or a cruise. And I will be cruising. Enough thirst trapping. Okay, I'm gonna take a minute here just to say how much I love Heidi in Closet or whatever her name is. I don't know. I think she's gonna change it. Spoiler. I love spoiling your day. <laughs> Anyways, I just love her. I think she's gonna be the new Alyssa Edwards of the season. You know, every season has an Alyssa Edwards. A lovable queen, that lovable goofball. You don't know why, you just love her. And I think Heidi is it this season. She is that goofball. I freaking love Heidi. <laughs> if she doesn't win this, she deserves to be an all-star. I'm just saying. 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 My eyebrows are getting on point. Ooh, let's make everything else match those. <laughs> mm. I am Anita Bryant. <laughs> oh, girl, you can't tell me my contour don't look good. <laughs> Anyways, oh, so, oh, God. break time. Hey, queens. Let's recap where we were. <laughs> you like how I'm looking right now? <clears throat> I had to dip into the alien palette one more time, and I gotta say that one green color alien that is just oh, and Titan makes such a wonderful blend color <laughs> to blend out for the brow. That is just, I just love this. I love this. You know, the original look I had like a little dot, and I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna. Ah, I'm gonna Erica Badu this bitch. Now on my liner turned out pretty good. Uh, you know. Anyways, to recap, runway. Bring it to the runway. I'm somewhere in this glove. Hee <laughs> hee. Anyways, um, to recap. Uh, first of all, Gigi's that Dior silhouette. That was just epic. Seriously, watch the damn show so you know what I'm talking about. This feels like a James Mansfield video. Anyways, um, Gigi, that Dior silhouette's fun. Heidi looks so beautiful. All of them look so beautiful. Crystal's look I loved. It was like a Tim Burton nightmare in acid. <sighs> Anyways, and, uh, and, you know, Heidi's commercial was amazing. So it was Crystal's, Jackie's, Jackie's Magic Merkin, which is just per which is perfect for you. <laughs> Love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. And what is stuck on my face? Ugh. Anyways, and then um, I just, I just, you know, it's just really, you know, it's really funny that the girls who were usually on the top were in the bottom this week. Um, so sad that Widow got in the bottom. Um, I am kind of sad that Jan's got in the bottom, but I do understand why she's in the bottom. She went at 100. She needed to kind of trick her down a few notches, you know, you know. That's what I just mean. And well, anyways, now I'm watching Untucked, so excuse me. Hello, lovelies. <laughs> you know what I love about this look? All I have to wear is a wig and some and a piece of underwear. A wig and a panty. Panty. Yes, panty. That's what I'm wearing. Not a thong. You're gonna have to deal with my wonky eyelash. No, it's not actually wonky, it's just bent. But anyways, um, so, I just gotta say, I just gotta say, maybe if Jan focused a little more on showing herself during the competition, it would be, ah. Uh, it would have ended a little differently. Oh God, this thing is freaking hot. It would have ended a little differently, but this 
this eyelash. I just... And it's not a right eye, left eye thing. It's just this eyelash. It's... I gotta... I gotta work on these eyelashes. I, I do. I gotta, I gotta make some new eyelashes. Anyways, so I hope you enjoyed my thoughts, my meandering. FYI, Jan did say on her Twitter that she was a tryhard. So nothing bad I said. Really. Did, 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 did. Oh well. Anyways, I'm glad you got to sit here with me. And um, FYI, apparently. The drag queen formerly known as Tyra Sanchez, um, who now likes to be called by his real name, James, um, and stirring up trouble, as per usual. Uh, and apparently, uh, there is a filter on Instagram to where you can actually have like a tank with an anglerfish in it just sitting somewhere. And apparently people were, people were going up, oh my god, on some people, on some very popular people on Instagram, they were apparently, uh, followers were just like, oh my god, that's just so cruel of you, da 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 da, -da. you don't know nothing about taking care of fish. Are we really at that point to where a filter is causing drama? I mean, I'm just wondering, I'm just asking. But anyways, that's another thought. Anyways, be kind, be you. And remember, it's my cup, it's my business. Don't judge me. Anyways, be kind, be you, and always have fun, and goddamn this eyelash. All right, bye, bye, I gotta go fix this thing. I gotta, damn remote, damn hair. This is why I only wore this thing once before. Well, you know, come on, come on, come on, come on.